blast of a cannon, the Hawaiian Chieftain sailed into Sacramento today. The big ship, based in Washington, will be here for six weeks. It'll give school kids a close-up look at sailing on a tall ship. And you can visit on board and even take a sail yourself. But as News 10's Dave Marquis reports, just being on the ship can be a life-changing experience. blast of a three-pounder cannon that sent birds wheeling and tourists snapping, the Hawaiian chieftain might have left you wondering if it was 1850 again, except for the tower bridge in the background. It's something you can't describe. It's something everybody has to experience for themselves. So. Especially for the newer deckhands when they hit the last big storm we had off the coast of Eureka. We are getting some pretty good waves over the bow coming down the coast. And it was a pretty good time. Is it well? It was Laura Whitmore's first time on the open sea. I was just coming up to the deck, and all of a sudden I saw that the, gun, uh, the ship was kind of tilted, and the water was coming in the gun ports, and the crew was running everywhere. But well-trained and ready for anything, the volunteer deckhand went right to work. Well, you don't really have time to be scared. It's more like what's best for the boat and what you really have to do. Uh, focusing on hauling on those lines when they're slick and sliding through your fingers. You don't really have time to be scared until after it's over. Laura took to the rigging like an old salt and now hangs calmly nearly 70 feet above the deck as she stows the mainsail. Sometimes, you know, things may not go quite according to plan and you kind of have to adapt while you're up there, but it's a really great skill. Crew members nearly always wear harnesses high above the deck but still have some heart-stopping moments. I've slipped a couple times. I haven't actually fallen, um, but luckily you also have your hands hanging on. From its cozy but cramped kitchen to the end of the bowsprit, the Hawaiian chieftain is as close as you can get to the days of sailing. This is definitely something that's going to stick with me for the rest of my life. If there's no way I could ever forget it. In Old Sacramento, Dave Marquis, wow. News 10. Well, during the week, the tall ship welcomes school tours on board. But on weekends, you can tour the ship from 10 a.m. until 1 p.m. for just a small donation. And then from 2 until 4 o'clock in the afternoon, you can actually go for a sale for about 50 bucks, regular price, a little less for kids and older folks. You can learn, learn more about it on our website, news10.net.